I wanted to do a quick uh, little video discussing God and music. I have an RTB video out there on the, uh, where is it, uh, 2019 program, uh, just discussing aesthetics and the necessity for something to be beyond that which grounds, you know, mathematics and music frequencies, vibrations, all that stuff. So um, this is just something I'm doing off the cuff because uh, just going through the YouTubes there and saw one of my favorite drummers who actually both of us have a mutual um, influence, which is Billy Cobham. Uh, the drummer here is Dennis Chambers. He's a believer. Um, I think Victor Wooten is also a believer. I'm not quite sure. But if this is anything that would be exemplary or um, picturesque, even an image of what is in my heart when I play drums and, um, you know, music like this, this is my style of music. This is the stuff I play, uh, love to play it, but just the beauty of the rhythms, uh, touch my heart so much. I, I was brought to tears just by listening to this. I, I just wanted to play a few, uh, bars here, so to speak. Now Dennis is going to come in with this really cool halftime funk shuffle. It's going to sound rhythmically strange at first to people, but it's beautiful. Stroking there, kind of like the Rosanna. The Jeff Picaro groove. I don't know, here, here he comes in the, the Kaba Mask groove. I love to play this stuff. This is where I just feel the presence of God and go into worship with playing drums. Just great instrumental music. here but uh, to me music is a reflection of the spiritual realm uh, Mikio 
or Michio Kaku in his book on um, parallel universes or parallel worlds. Could be one of his other books. I can't remember. I've read a few of them. He talks about the fact uh, that um, once we get to strings, that's the music of the universe, that the universe is fundamentally uh, musical. That's uh, really what appeals to me with string theory, that the plucking of a, uh, who knows what to call it, a, a string of, of energy uh, gives rise to these um, very interesting notes that are played throughout creation. So there has to be something that grounds and unifies uh, the multiplicity of tones. And uh, this is where even um, Heraclitus, the modern, modern fa father of, they say, existentialism, everything was becoming. But he actually postulated this uh, concept of the logos, which was, for all practical purposes, God that gave reason to all the flux and chaos. So it gave cosmos to chaos. Uh, this is the one in the mini again. I just wanted to uh, share a little bit of my thoughts concerning God and music.